Hi Scorpio, it's Al. I hope everybody is doing well. Before we get into it, guys, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you'd like to be notified every time I do post a new video. Like, comment, share, show your love and support. As always, please keep it positive. If you'd like a personal reading, that information is going to be in the description box below. I'm only doing a few for now. I've opened them up just for a short period of time. You guys know I don't really do them anymore all the time. So that information is in the description box below. Also, if you'd like to donate, these are free readings. Any donations are much appreciated. Uh, we have been through some transformations, um, even through my marriage. Look, there it is, uh, with a hair front ear um, since I've been married here and um, in life that have not been very um, cheap. Like everybody, I feel like, you know, we're human beings <laughs> um, all going through it at this time, right? But we ended up getting my daughter out of a uh, bad situation anyway. Um, I can't really talk a lot about it on, on the internet, but that's where I've been most of the time is just trying to get life together, living life, right? Being productive. But anyway, there's a little bit more of an in-depth, um, if you'd like to, um, donate description in the description box for our GoFundMe as well. Um, you guys know, uh, if you watch me, I'm a cancer survivor. So getting back into the world, right? Workforce, all that good stuff, lifing. Um, anywho, still too. So, and I'm still trying to show up for you guys. I haven't had as much time, but I'm trying to make it more of a daily thing in my life. I'm being pushed this way. So here we go, right? So I love you guys. 144 on the clock. Let's do it. I feel like it, that's the message I've been seeing a lot lately too. Page of Swords. Uh, message yeah uh page of one so there's definitely um that activist energy um being ignited right that's what that means to me too it's like the energy of right your voice scorpio right could be of importance right now um spirit could be pushing you more towards your voice in that regard right so also we're selling candles now i do have archangel michael candles they are a wooden three wick candle um see here with the red i love it for archangel michael um it has white sage palo santo and geranium um oils these smell great fragrance oils and then we have um i have a white sage and palo santo white it's just a white candle with three wooden wicks it's burning here so i don't want to pick it up it's hot uh same type of candle exactly just white instead of red three wooden wicks these are soy candles smell and this one is just white sage and palo santo energy cleansing um very calming aromatic they burn for a long period of time and um, smell great so take advantage of them we have made already and ready to ship out um little side hustle action going on right <laughs> Uh, I decided I wanted to venture in making some more candles again. So uh, if you would like a candle, that information is going to be in the description box below as well, guys. I'm going to go ahead and get into it. Um, the ending of a situation here, Scorpio, where you feel like somebody hasn't been really necessarily truthful with you or hasn't had um, your best interest in heart, right? So I do feel like whatever this is, there's some type of... Um, in regards to integrity here or what you're worth, being paid what you're worth. Okay, Nine of Pentacles, right? You are... Um, and this energy of 333 being divinely protected as I looked up. Okay, Scorpio, right? So they're really like, it's almost over. Don't worry, right? The moon card. Something is going to be revealed for to you, for you, for you. Here's the justice card. So in regards to, yeah, the six of wands and success here moving forward in a situation. Something where something hasn't been fair. If something hasn't been fair in a situation, it is be, being made right or will be made right. Uh, this could even be like, again by libra season we are moving back into the fall uh my favorite season by the way <laughs> not just because i'm a scorpio but it it is my favorite um so let's get into it guys spirit angels ancestors guys please help me provide scorpio sun moon rising with any messages you would like for them to receive also protect us with your white light of protection to the tarot archangel michael please block any negative energy being sent our way send it back into the universe into nothingness amen, amen. I 
I said at 333 Confirmation, Spirit wants you to know you do have support here with some type of community here. There's some type of talent here. Seeing the angel number 333 is a sign that it's time to focus inward, work on your skills, discover your talents, and use your imagination. So some of you guys, this is directly under the nine of pentacles where there's been some type of situation here where you feel like you haven't been able to stand on your own. Uh, this is Spirit saying that you are, right? With the nine of pentacles, the number 333 is also a very supportive energy thing being made fair, being made right, coming to light here. Uh, one, 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 take action. It's time, right? So it's time for you to actually, you know, um, I feel like really focus on having whatever this fresh start, this new start, this new, um, energy is with this moon energy, Scorpio, uh, I feel like the sooner you get to going, the sooner you're going to accomplish what it is that you set out to do, right? So if there has been something on pause here with whatever this energy is for you guys, yeah, it has to do with commitments or something you've been committing yourself to or had some type of commitment to yourself in regards to uh, 1010, it's up to you, right? I've seen, I've seen this download recently a couple times too this past week. So I definitely feel like this is confirmation with things being up to you energetically, right? You know, it's confirmation spirit saying basically, hey, Five, 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 as I'm saying it, right? Things are going to change, but it is up to you, right? So to take some sort of action. Um, there's definitely some type of unconditional love here. Beautiful energy, Scorpio, too, out on the table that you're going to be experiencing. It could be within a community. It could be within some type of action here. There's this all, also this energy, Scorpio, though, of following your heart, following your heart in regards to what you feel like is right. Yep, here's direction here and timing here. Um, there is going to need to, you're going to need to kind of be able to see in the dark like a bat with that flexibility here, uh, rolling the dice, taking a risk in the situation. I feel like some of you already are aware of this, whoever I'm speaking to, right? There's something about saving face here in a situation. Somebody could be trying to save face in some regard. What is this message for Scorpio? And it has to do with progress for you. You moving forward, okay? Your efforts are going to pay off soon, so stay um, stay on course for at least a few more months before making a change, Spirit is saying. Like, so whatever it is that you're doing, you understand that there's some type of course that you have to take over the next few months in regards to some type of progress here. Now, you see how there's sand here. It could be, you know, there could be this feeling of, like, it feels rough to walk through sand, right? So there is this energy of, though, making this change, though. It might not be the easiest change, Scorpio. Change is not always easy, right? But this is about the future here and your future. Plan for the future while living and the present you were always supported by spirit some of you it says and then and then if i'm speaking to my psychics here see how we have uh the crystal ball or my natural intuitives natural mystics right this energy of your psychic abilities can bring you prosperity so some of you do have a natural gift natural talent here in regards to something that's actually going to transform your life here where there's been an ending here okay so again some of you could be bring, bringing in some type of prosperity uh star power again um you need engaging work that shows off talents, whoever I'm speaking to, right? So I feel like this is e either being seen or this is like you being pushed in this energy. All right, Scorpio, uh, some of you could be your natural actor or influence influencer, excuse me, you attract fame and fortune to you. This is the, the vibe, the, ha the energy that you have is so intense. It's star power energy, Scorpio, of, of course, right? Scorpio energy is intense. Um, you're being protected from deceit in situations that no longer serve you. So again, with this energy, again, direction, divine guidance, direction, divine guidance, <laughs> direction, divine guidance, Scorpio gifts. You're uncovering new talents and gifts, spiritual gifts. Some of you, there's definitely some type of spiritual gift that's connected to whatever this is as well. Let's do the angel tarot for Scorpio. The devil. Okay, seduction and downfall. Be careful here, Scorpio, in regards to whatever that, however that resonates with you. Uh, Queen of Swords, it could be in regards to Queen of Swords energy or it's just spirit saying cut out what lo no longer serves you in regards to some type of sexual energy moving forward. What other messages? <laughs> we don't need to keep on elaborating, right? With the Ace of Pentacles, Scorpio. 
divine blessings. This is also the energy of de driving evil away. So again, or, again, with some type of message, if you've been reaching out to spirit asking for protection, because we do have that here, things being revealed to you, protection being on the table, again, confirmation. Um, there's definitely the energy of being saved from some type of situation here my friends. There's also the energy of driving some type of evil energy away on the table. Things being made right. Four of cups, healing energy. Somebody didn't want you to heal from something that was in reverse. They wanted something to be unrepairable or you not be able to heal. The nine of swords, it has to do with anxiety, uh, healing, preserving health. Again, with the nine of cups here, though, there's the energy of you being happy and fulfilled, which is coming true in that regard. So, okay. Three of pentacles. You've definitely been protected here against some type of sorrow or illness there's also mental force here in regards to some type of a situation with the nine of wands universal medicine and love for you guys you understand something spirit understands you know something here again i'm speaking possibly to even some of my healers here with the nine of wands you know the energy of going through a lot you're very um yeah has made you passionate towards spirit here with communication i love it so again there's also the energy of being guided here you know along the road there was deceptive energy the ten of wands well communication spirit has definitely not left your side um what other messages do we have for scorpio whatever this is in regards to with the two of swords there's definitely a situation in regards to work intellectual talent knowledge of something that you're bringing victory in regards to or will be magic okay Okay, so you have the power now to use your magic to attract what you want in your life. The sky is the limit or sky is the limit here with magic. So understanding how powerful you are truly, Scorpio, standing in your power. I love it. Um, yeah, there's some type of releasing, some type of vice or addiction or addictive energy here. Um, yeah, and a spirit is calling down judgment here on a situation. I, I don't understand why with the five of swords. Okay, there was a lot of negative energy attached to something and it was just time is what I'm getting here. What else can you tell us with the king of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, masculine energy? A lot of you had to be in a really masculine energy, emperor energy. Yeah, with the defensive energy, uh, king of pentacles. And some of you, it could have had to do with a work situation. If not, it just could have been in a situation where, you know, um, in regards to a, hmm, I don't know, whatever it had to do with, if it was a marriage, if it was a situation with work, whatever it was, it was a commitment, basically, Scorpio, where there was definitely some type of building on something together, a tower here, but somebody is definitely within a community had um, some type of... Um, saw some opportunity here. Okay, so... It, <laughs> This is stupid. So it was almost like somebody saw an opportunity to just bring stress in your life. So they just wanted it to. Yeah. In your home life for some of you. But with the devil card in reverse, I feel like it had, had just and maybe you didn't allow it to affect. Yeah. There's a six of swords. So some of you moved um, to calmer waters, or moved or moved or moving. Um, again, with the three of pentacles, there was this energy though of being divinely guided here in regards to a situation i feel like you are aware became aware of here it has to do with either abuse of authority in a situation in regards to money why is this coming through for scorpio eight of pentacles queen of swords I guess because it's it, whoever this is for, you need to understand when it's time to look at something differently. What's supposed to stay? What's supposed to go? Divine guidance, divine intervention. Here's the Empress energy. All right. So staying in a high vibe, Scorpio, there's definitely a new opportunity for you. Again, I do feel like there was some type of like control kind of. It could even be somebody wanted you to miss an opportunity with some type of work here, wanted to walk away from some type of an opportunity. I don't know. 
Oh, this is wonky energy. I don't want to be stuck in it. What other messages? Why is this important? Um, yeah, I just see you moving forward with the four of one state balance. It could be towards a soulmate connection or uh, twin flame. If it's not that it's just a new beginning state balance, mind, body and soul being happy, being happy within being happy at home. There was some type of betrayal here in the past. And I do feel like balance is key here with whatever the message is coming out. I do feel like a lot of you really grew through something. There was some type of unexpected shift that ch caused change. Um, again, taking chances. I do feel like there's some type of freedom and optimism moving towards this uh, future and success. One, two, three, four, and good luck. It's like you are on the good side of karma. Whatever it is, there's lessons learned, and it says with it with the with a T, right? Um, completion there's definitely nine 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 um some type of accomplishment though it's like you've made it through some type of you know uh transition in your life here then now the spirit wants you to know there's limitless potential or maybe you needed to see that you had limitless potential in situations and you weren't giving yourself credit for that scorpio i feel like that's really what it is is what it feels like to me at least yeah persistence here so again gratitude new experiences excuse me contentment um know that these are are on your way if you've been seeing 12 12 that's also confirmation um and some of you have a lovely partnership whatever however that resonates for you right or an epic romance that's also in the card so it's it's really good scorpio uh you've been persistent and here's the void here with some type of situation that caused some type of stress here um i feel like for some of you here uh there was some type of um action in that regard where you know you chose to deal with something and it more positive way than you have in the past right which shifted the energy again perseverance you persevered through something good job i love it wisdom exactly what i was saying enlightening so spiritual awakening here transformation energy scorpio uh, a lot of you i've been seeing butterflies too so transformative energy too again confirmation with that um, are going through transformative situations in your life right now uh what other messages do we have for scorpio perception of unity all right so there's definitely here's the transformation endings and but new beginning so there's a new beginning here there's something being made right in regards to something that was taken from you we've got restitution and success um something here uh you know some of you could be even traveling here truth and justice here in a situation in regards to yeah breaking the circle here where there was oppressive energy so again um divine power confidence is key my friends whoever i'm speaking to there's divine grace being given to you in a situation i feel like you know if you've been really asking for divine grace um and help here in a situation and guidance it's, it's just that it's being given to you there's protection uh where there was betrayal spirit wants you to know there's refuge right you have the power within here with this energy of magic and this high vibration with a new beginning you know just waiting right in front of you here right love is the highest vibration scorpio spirit is saying stay balanced here um you know um it is what it is talking i guess people are talking but you're like you don't care right yeah working on something you're repairing something here working on repairing and that's all you're focused on um there was some type of situation here where there was some type of an emotional block scorpio but i feel like you're not in the energy of feeling like whatever that was there is there anymore yeah something felt like it wasn't enough and you were frustrated but here it's again there's light and healing energy here so for some of you you've definitely you know uh, there's insane chemistry too here for some of you and burning desire to be with somebody in equal interest um again very passionate energy uh scorpio so really dive into feeling like you know what um honor and protection determination with the sword and rose it almost feels like spirit is saying you've earned this right there was some type of heartbreak in the past but again it's like almost it don't sabotage something good here there's a new message or message of love expressing love thinking of you and for more informing you love call so somebody could also be giving you a call soon scorpio um confirmation with whatever that is loud outside okay one more message for scorpio 
really focus on what's going to make things efficient and calm in your home right now. Spirit is really wanting you to uh, see something confirmation. Your ancestors are. You're being held in high honor in your defined feminine energy and your ancestry. And there's some type of determination, again, that has to do with, you know, making it through to the other side, the mountain here, um, the hill, other side of the hill, but this says the mountain though, but it has to do with like some type of, you know, again, breaking again, resilience, nine of wands, my wounded warriors, breaking the cycles, right? So the, the ones that are, you know, chosen to end or break generational curses this lifetime, here we go, right? So one more card splitting the deck. Ten of Pentacles. Before I started the reading, that's what the the card that came out. Um, let's see. Clarify for me the Ten of Pentacles. King of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, masculine energy, new cycles coming in. There could be energies competing for um, some type of collaboration here, Scorpio, with the Eight of Cups here. Um, the King of Pentacles is somebody who's very strategic here. So about your success here in regards to, you know, success here, we've got a masculine and feminine energy, maybe be balanced in both here. Again, we have both, right? We embody both. So there's this energy needing to be strategic, but also very loving feminine um, and understanding when it's time to walk away from something here so, and when it's not moving forward, there is something being made fair. Again, confirmation and the Nine of Pentacles, Scorpio. So that came out in the last reading I did too. I love you guys. So extra confirmation on that note. Um, I don't want to be redundant today. One more message. Spirit is saying make it work. You have all the... Uh, all of what you need to make it work it's going to work right so uh if you were second guessing yourself stop all right um let's see a love message before i end it one more message in regards to love for scorpio past person present person new person love message they need time to heal right now. They think that you're really smart, Scorpio. Your talent, your intellect turns this person on, but they're actually healing as well. You're definitely their favorite, though, and they like showing out or they like, you know, they're trying to let the past go in regards to situation two. They like that you show out or something of that nature, vice versa, or like it when you do. I think this more of this person kind of feels like, yeah, their Aries energy. Okay. Yeah. They like, it's like they like you seeing them in this stance right whatever it is Scorpio uh they show out for you so this person's definitely if you feel the vibe um if they're doing it it's, it's definitely for you it looks like here so um so maybe this person whether you know they're sending you vibes and it's kind of like they don't yeah they're <sighs> Scorpio energy Some of you, they see this, you're, you're going through a lot and needing to heal as well. And just are looking like, I don't want to cause this person stress here. There's also the energy of creative energy showing up here being watched. So again, some of you that are definitely in some type of creative community, you're being watched here. And something is going to come out that makes you happy in some regards. There could be an opportunity here. Um, I do feel like it could even be some type of opportunity while traveling. Queen of Swords energy. There's also an ending here to something that no longer serves some of you here. What is this? Ten of Swords. Some type of addictive energy with the devil or toxic situation in regards to um, an equal give and take here. Four of Swords energy. Okay, so... For my masculines here, be careful about overextending yourself when it's not re reciprocated or my feminines end up in more of a masculine energy. You need to take time to recharge. Okay, um, there's definitely going to be a reconnect here with you and this person, but there's also the energy of needing to kind of disconnect in order to reconnect. Um, you're going to have a breakthrough here, but especially with love and work here, I feel like there's more of the need to focus on renewal in your life here. And then the rest is going to follow, right? Yeah. The, here's the balance card again. All right. So I love you guys. Um, yeah, there's soul searching again. Uh, spirit is really wanting you to think about something. And I guess whoever needs this message, will know it. Um, I love you. I hope this message is helpful until next time. Lots and love and light. Bye.